ओके फ्रेंड्स ना वाट आम टू डूज आम टू क्रिएट यूरो सर्वर वट इज यूरो सर्वर हे यूरो सर्वर इज नथिंग बट इट्स ए सर्विस रिजिस्ट्री वेर आल दि मैक्रो सर्विस रिजिस्टर दम जेल से ओके सो दिस यूरो सर्विस इज इज लाइक सर्विस रिजिस्ट्री फ्रॉम नेटफ्लिक्स लाइब्ररी सो दिस इज ए पार्ट ऑफ स्प्रिंग क्लाउड इको सिस्टम ओके सो दट विल हेल्प यू टू रिजिस्टर द मैक्रो सर्विस सो सो दे कैन बी डिस्कवर्ड एंड कॉल्ड बै अदर मैक्रो सर्विस okay so let's create the eureka server here so let's uh, take in, uh, spring initializer here and let's provide some group id techno down techy okay and let's provide like uh, artifact id here eureka server and after that uh, provide some description demo for eureka server here okay let's remove this and provide the main package here okay i'm going to use the maven build tool here and uh, apart from this we need like spring web dependency and we need eureka server here okay and let's generate this project and let's open our intellij id here and let's unzip this project just open Eureka server in IntelliJ. Okay, now so let's open our main application, and here what you need to do is you have to enable Eureka server here by using this annotation. Okay, enable Eureka server here, and after that we need to create one application dot ML file. Okay, so let's create application dot ML file here. Okay. so in this application at ml file so we have to provide application name here okay so i am going to provide eureka server here okay and after that uh, we need to provide some port number so default port number is 8761 here okay so that's it uh, now let's start this application and let's see okay application has been started and let's see now so this uh, this eureka server will show you like some of the information related to the system status and apart from this uh, you can see this instances currently running with eureka here so the application itself eureka itself as uh, uh, treated as a micro services here right so in this case what you have to do is you have to provide like some of the information here so to get rid of this what you have to do is okay and go to your application that ml file so here eureka client and after that we have a like registered with eureka okay so we have to provide false here and after that we have like um fetch registry as well so that is also make it false here now let's restart this okay it's restarted go back here and let's hit this now so this eureka server is gone now from this instances okay so now we need like eureka client here right what i'm going to do is i'm going to create one of the micro service that is product service here and after that i'm going to register that micro service with this eureka server here okay and let's go back to our spring initializer here and let's create uh some product service okay and demo for product service here okay and here also can provide main package and remove this eureka server add our client eureka client here okay eureka discovery client to register with our eureka server okay and add lombok for setter and getters and let's generate this project and let's unzip this okay and let's go back to our ide let's open this project into our ide here okay and go to main resources and add our application dot ml file here okay here i'm going to provide a spring application name that is our product service here and after that provide server port number 
okay add zero add one here and after that we need to define the service client service url okay that is default zone is this is our eureka server url here okay and uh, we need to create like one of the controller here okay let's create some controller inside this package controller package i'm going to create product controller here okay let's maximize this and provide the rest controller and request mapping okay i'm going to provide some path that is uh, products here and after that uh, let's create uh, some data here okay a uh, private list so product okay i need to create some of the products here rs as list okay so let's create product uh, domain class here or model class okay um, so inside this uh, what i'm going to do is i'm going to create the data private int id private string name okay and private double price here okay and go back to your product controller here and let's import this and here new product inside this product i'm going to provide some product data so let's take some data here okay uh, we need to provide all arguments constructor as well okay come back here okay and after that uh, we need to provide some endpoint right so let's take some endpoint here product and here written the products here and after that get mapping okay so that's it our controller is ready and so an application that ml file also we have defined this right so go to our main application and just start this okay okay i think eureka server is stopped so let's start this and go back to our product service and restart this product service again and go back to our eureka server here and refresh this you will see the product service here let's click on this and here so let's provide products here okay so you will see the products data here okay and if you can see here you can see this um, instance application name and the status here right uh, here you can see some application name right so with the ip and the service name and the port number so if you want to override that you can do it um, so here this is the official documentation so here we have an option to change that and let me show you that one as well okay so this one changing the eureka instance id so how you are going to change this by using this one so let's copy this and come back here and go back to your application that ml file okay let's remove this eureka okay so instance instance id here uh, spring application name and after that application instance id application instance id some random value here okay and let's see this change let's restart this application it's restarted and let's hit this eureka server see product service okay your application name and after that some instance id okay and some random number here okay so uh, this is how you can do it and apart from this uh, what i can do is uh, i will add like one more instance here okay so let's add this application uh, i will naming as um, product 
सर्विस एप्लीकेशन टू ओके लेट्स ऐड मेन क्लास हेयर एंड हेयर ऐड वी एम ऐड वी एम ऑप्शन ओके इन दी एम ऑप्शन यू कैन ऐड डी सर्वर डॉट पोर्ट नंबर इक्वल टू एट जीरो एट थ्री ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट दिस सो दिस टाइम वी हैव स्टार्टेड लाइक टू इंस्टेंसेस ओके लेट्स गो बैक टू योर योर का सर्वर हियर लेट्स रिस्टार्ट दिस यू विल सी द टू इंस्टेंसेस हियर राइट एंड इफ यू वांट लाइक यू कैन चेक इट आउट इंग आर नॉट ओके राइट सो दिस इज हाउ इट विल गिव द डेटा हियर ओके